Good afternoon, everyone. Today, we're going to be taking a property tour that's located here on Coon Hollow Road, Sunbright, Tennessee. This property here has 1,300 feet of road frontage, has a fully stocked pond, a producing natural gas well that is currently being leased, but all rights will transfer over. We've got a small barn on the property. It's located just down the this little road here. Um, the board, the back border of the property, there is a uh, a creek down there. It's called Ann's Creek. Um, so let's go ahead and get started. I also need to mention there is fiber optics and electricity running down this road here. Uh, there's also a water main also where somebody can actually tap into city water. There's some fencing on the along the right side here. Now in this general area, there used to be a homestead that was there. And if you can see, there is an orange flag right about there where there is an a water well that can be reconditioned to be used. This whole property here used to be just used for uh, pushing cattle through. It's really nice land going down through here. Now what we're going to do, we're going to step over here in this side field and just take a look. Right there is a the little, the little pink flag. Just so when they're bush hogging, so that they don't run over this well. Right there's the well, and it's been hit a few times already. But that can be reconditioned to be in use again, I believe. Now right down here is the old barn. Currently not being, being in use. Take a walk down to the pond. Now, right over here is the gate where we come in at. The road front goes all the way down to right there where it's marked. Such a beautiful view going down through there. This probably makes somebody a nice, a nice homestead, a mini farm, or just a field to run your cattle or horses. And just right on top of this hill here, you can see the pond already. It's a little grown up with some lilies, but. A little bit of maintenance, it'll perk right back up. Now I've got a key to the gate. I could have drove back through here, but 
it's better if I can just walk and take a video of all the features that the property has to offer. And I have to say there is abundance of wildlife that come through this property just because of the water source, the lush green grass. Turkeys, deer, you name it. It's a pretty cool looking tree. I hope my camera isn't shaking too bad. Now this road, it goes all the way pretty close to the back of the property, at least up to where the fence ends. Now I told you once before that the entire property is fenced in, but the back fencing doesn't go all the way down to the creek, which is the border of the property, so keep that in mind. And if you want to copy the survey, just send me a text or an email and uh, I'll send you a copy. That way you can check it out yourself. Now right here, we're coming up on a, the gas wells. Now keep in mind that these gas wells are being leased. It's one of them 100 year leases. And I believe there's about 40 years left. And you can pull that lease from the county courthouse here in Morgan County, Tennessee. Wartburg is where the courthouse is located at. Now, if some of these parts are boring, you can you can fast forward if you need to and just go that route. There's that oil well. Now, the last couple of times this pump, this pump hasn't, uh, the cop, well, the while I was saying was, the last couple of times I've been down here, this pump has not um, been on. Right there is the information on the pump itself and a number that you can call if you need to. Right there's the permit number. be the timer and when it kicks on and off um, I'm not sure how to read that to find out when it comes on and off but there you go now right back here would be the perfect place away from everybody where you can build a home, a little uh, little pasture, another barn. Well, just really anything that you want. 
I'm gonna do a 360 here, that way we can get our bearings on screen. Of course, this is where we come from, right through here, and the field and the pond are back over in this way. Now, the last time I was here, I actually took off walking straight down this way and cut back down towards the, the creek area. But I believe this time I'm going to go off this way into the woods. Alright, if you give me one second, I'm gonna uh, get back get back to you and I'm gonna walk down here to this brook that drains out into the, the creek itself. Um, I just wanna make sure I don't step on anything. Alright, I'll be right back. Okay. I'm walking down through the uh, the right side of the property and I come from up in this direction here where the field's at about halfway in between a school bus that's up here and also um, some natural gas wells. So in between there on the right hand side, there's a little field um, where I, I came in at. And right here is the, this is the seasonal, we'll call it a brook going down through here, a little seasonal creek. Um, where the water actually drains off into um, into the Ann's Creek down here. I went in one direction and I couldn't find it and I had to call the owner. Um, so this is my first experience on this side of the property down this far. So I'm just gonna take y'all with me so we can check out the landscape. Uh, the property line is just a little bit further over. Um, it's actually, you can see the fence line there. There's a post that continues on down towards the creek area. Now right here's another little, a little small little creek, but I don't believe it's, Ann's Creek is just a little bit bigger than this. And it's actually coming from the other property owner's side.
All right, so what we're gonna do, we're gonna continue on down this way and just see what this property has to show us. All righty. So, here's a, here's this little brook. Um, there's some cool rock rock formations down here. You know, somebody could come down here and target practice because of the high hillside on the neighboring property. Um, really pretty little area. Now, right here is a fence going up through the property here. And I just wanna make sure, all right, I'm going to cut this off. I'm gonna look at my map real quick and see where we are at in relation to um, the boundary line. All right, and we're back. Go ahead and continue on following this little creek. Eventually we'll have to go back up, but we'll we'll just wait until we come to that crossing. Alright. Oh wow. That's really cool. A nice little overhang. Yeah. A root system up there. Now I'm about 6'1", so this height right here, I don't know, we'll call it five and a half foot. Okay, so we are almost in the right hand corner of the property um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm going to cross this fence and continue onward down uh, and follow the creek Pretty peaceful down here. All right, here we go. Hmm. Now I'm gonna walk right up here and then I'll come back down here so I can 
look down here at these uh, this rock formations that's falling along the creek line. But I'm curious. I'm gonna walk up here. All right, I had to stop and take a few pictures because um, I didn't take them last time I was here as far as being on this side of the property. This is really neat. Let me get over here in dry land so I don't get my feet wet. All right. Wow. Now, if you can imagine this, when it comes down to rain, this whole area will fill up and there'll be a pool of water rushing down through here. Almost like a swimming hole. All right, now, right there is Ann's Creek. And here's the little brook that feeds that. This would be a great place to come down and go camping. Be away from everybody. Go hunting. I mean, this whole area is abundant with wildlife, including white-tailed deer, turkey. So pretty. But those are my opinions, and you guys make a decision for yourself. Tell me what you all think about the property. I'm gonna walk down here to where this little natural bridge is at. Now, this will be considered the property line. So everything back this way would belong to you if you are the lucky person to purchase this property. Um, and that all that land belongs to the neighboring property owner. Uh, I try to cross that, but I probably slip. So let's... Uh, Let's continue on back up towards the the field and see what we can see from there. I'm gonna take a quick video. All right, I'll get back with y'all here in just a second. I'm gonna start heading back up towards the field. 
Okay, real quick. I seen this cool little rock formation. I had to get a little video for you all. It almost looks like a trail that was used by some sort of animals. Ah, check this out. And this is all on the property that's being sold right now. This little rock facing is aiming right towards the creek area. Now, I don't know if there's any fish in this creek, um, but I can definitely find that out for you. Alrighty. All right. So we made it out of there. Now keep in mind, There's a lot of footage before you get to the creek that is covered in that thick, um, thick kind of shrub that grows near creeks. So I had to cross through that. Had a little damage involved, but I'm good. So, as you can see, well, let me get to the clearing here. You can see right there, that's where the, uh, that's where the gas, natural gas wells are at. All right, so I'm going to go right over here past this pump and walk this clearing that I had showed you all earlier. We got distracted. The place uh, where I believe you'd make a nice little home. I don't know if you can see them, but a lot of trails. I'm assuming they're either the canine variety or it's a deer trail coming through here. Because you got food up there in the field. You got water at the pond and down there where the creek is located at as well. I apologize if my camera keeps on focusing in and out. I've got it on the uh, cinematic so we'll walk up here to the tip and then we'll turn around and uh, face the oil well so we can you know just get like a, a visual distance
Alright. Here we go. You can see right there is the oil well. So you've got you got about an acre right here. Had a, sorry, had a spider jump on me. I don't like that. All right, so what we're gonna do now, we're gonna walk back up towards the field and walk around a little bit, check some things out, and then we are gonna, we are gonna call it quits. And be the conclusion of this video. All right, we made it back to the main field I'm just gonna walk around this pond area. Then we'll walk to the, the little the little hill and look around a little bit and we're going to conclude this video. I'm pretty happy that the weather cooperated with me so I can do this. Ah, almost here. And of course, the main road's up there where you can see the power lines at. Take a little 360 here. Well, for everybody watching this uh, this video, I appreciate you taking a look. If you have any questions, feel free to contact me at my office at 931-879-9169. And on my cell phone number, it'll be 931-704-4618. Give me a call. Let's schedule a time to show the property. And uh, I'll talk to you soon.